Hey everybody, welcome back to Parsons and Parsimony. The girls headed over to a friend's house today and I just dropped them off and that's right close to Price Chopper. I thought I'm gonna run in and see what kind of bargains I can find today. They had their pasta on sale for 49 cents a pound as well as some yogurt. So a couple of their sales I definitely wanna get and I'm hoping I find some markdown meats. I am back from Price Chopper and I did find a lot of markdowns today. Not all of them did I get because even though they were good deals, they weren't as good as some of the other deals and I just didn't need the items, but they did have a lot of markdowns, which usually I don't see quite this much at Price Shopper. I'm gonna do an unpack with me and show you guys what I got. So this is something I have never bought before. I've never purchased these before, but in the produce section, they were marked down. They had a $1.50 coupon off on them. I'll put a picture of what that looked like. And so this was normally $2.50 with $1.50 off. So that was a dollar for this. This is 12 ounces. So it's about the going rate of what I usually pay for broccoli when it's a decent price. So I went ahead and got four of those. And I am going to try roasting broccoli. So many people have said broccoli roasted is so wonderful. So I want to give, take one of these packages, toss it in the oven, and see how my kids like it and if it's something I should do more often or not. So that was a good deal there. <clears throat> they also had this raw shrimp, and this was only $4.99 a pound. This is normally $11.99, so I thought that was a pretty good price. It's a pound, and I'm usually, a few of the kids like shrimp, but usually I will just cook up a small amount for me. I'll put it on a salad because I don't have many shrimp lovers in the house. And then they had in their markdown pile here, a box of rotini markdown whoops, for 50 cents a box, which is actually what their sale price was on pasta this week. They didn't have many of these Dannon yogurts, but I like this for Trim Healthy Mama and for just a quick, quick, quick breakfast when I'm running out of the house. They had a coupon for 10 for 49 cents a piece. So that is a really good savings on these. The last time I stocked up on these, they lasted me almost two months. So I don't eat them a lot, but they are really handy to have. They also had ice cream. Uh, I think this is one and a half quarts, yes, for 99 cents. And I know Art loves black raspberries, so I thought I'm gonna surprise him with a special treat. We don't have, and not, I don't think we've had this flavor in a very long time, so that's my surprise to Art. After being married for almost 20 years, one of the things that I have learned is do little things that your husband would appreciate. And getting his favorite ice cream is something I know that he will appreciate. It's a little thing, but it's just one of those things to remind him that we still are very much in love even though we have eight kids and we've been married 20 years. Moving on here, uh, this was not on sale, but, uh, well, it was on sale, uh, but it's the same price as Aldi, and we're making some granola this week, so I went ahead and picked that up so I didn't have to run to Aldi. The Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce was 99 cents, and then they had their pasta on sale, 49 cents a pound if you bought four boxes. So I went ahead and got four of those boxes. Seltzer, because we don't drink soda, was on sale for 88 cents. And then lastly, I picked up ugh, this package of chicken thighs. It was on sale for 88 cents a pound. And good price, not marked down, but still, this is my dinner for tonight. We'll probably do the chicken and the broccoli and maybe some mac and cheese to go along with it. So everything came to $23.12. I did earn Price Chopper reward points. I actually applied some from my last order. I don't shop at Price Chopper that much, so I don't have a lot of reward points, but that was $1.52 also off my order. So it says that I saved $23.56. By their calculations, I saved over 50%. Well, that's it, a little mini grocery haul. I, one of these days, I'll get to Aldi and do a bigger haul, but for now, I'm just eating out of our stores. I'm happy doing it that way for a little while, giving our budget a little bit of a break. Doesn't hurt anything, and I'll see you for the next video. Thanks for watching. Have a fabulous day. Bye.